Hey, what's up, you guys? Back to my channel. Today's video is only for this week is a doodle me video because I was crunched on time, but I still want to do a video for you guys. So, guys, get into it. And today I'm using a little bit of a different material. This I don't know what specific this is, but this is 0 0.5 mechanical pencil. It does very specific to anything that goes on about drawing with this. Please tell me down below. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I really don't. And also, I will be honest, I had to redo this video because I just wasn't feeling it. I just wasn't feeling the doodles and this was just two different days of just doodling, but it just wasn't right in the time to film. But I'm really excited to do this video for you guys today. And plus, I mean, like a lot of stuff has happened in the past week, which is really weird for me. First off, um, about the, if anybody's wondering, I know nobody's really watching this video, but if anybody's wondering like how my work, work life going, it's like, it's getting chaotic. It's gonna get even more chaotic because what I just agreed to is really, really uh, chaotic. <laughs> really chaotic. And what I agreed to was just becoming a manager and I'm kind of scared at the same time not because I know I can do it. It's just, I, I never been a leader of a full group of people before, but I know if I at least try, I can do really well at it and just have a good time. And I just want to do better. I still want to do better for myself. As well, I was just overthinking how I wanted to approach my YouTube videos for a second. Like, I was thinking about doing a voiceover. But I'm like, if I'm doing a doodle with me video, I want to be raw and in the video. The other video, if I do another video, like, of a different type, of course I'm going to have to do that. But I kind of want to make more the doodle with me videos keep remaining as a raw um, subject matter for me. Because it's just in the moment. It's, n it's just nothing planned and it's a really good uh, drawing exercise because you just come up with ideas and you just see what you think would be the right thing to do or the wrong thing to do i don't know why i made it mad i made it mad you to emphasize it yeah i'm gonna emphasize it getting some jowls some jowls but I'm really excited to becoming a manager. It is just very, very intimidating in the beginning because I had my first day to start as a manager is actually coming come Monday for me. And I'm just kind of freaking out a little bit, but I know I can do it. Also, I'm thinking also, and I'm also like, as I do, I'm thinking about other like character designs that I could do because I kind of, I just really am into making a whole world of just my little weird just dysfunctional family of characters and i really want to keep do, keep doing that in general because it's so much fun to make characters it's so much fun to do a lot of things and i don't even know what these type of people are you remind me of the character i created called tv which if you haven't seen it i'll show you real quick because i really don't care because i know this is so unprofessional, but it's professional enough for me. Yes. Oh God, I ruined it. Oh. <laughs> this is the reason why. But this is TV and you can see like, he's like a little, I don't know, he's sure, a little warm thing. A little warm, a little warm, a little calculator. <gasps> oh my God, he was a calculator heart, bro. I'm sorry, I'm, ideas are popping up. I'm, I'm sorry, ideas are just popping up now. Okay, thank you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so stupid, I'm so stupid. But I'm just getting about ideas and like, that would be so freaking dope. Oh my God. Have you like a, a mafia family? Okay, <gasps> the Icy Gang gets the Breezy Gang. Um, <clears throat> I'm sorry, I'm just coming up with ideas. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm just coming up with dumb ideas because it was like, like when I, cause for some, for a good chunk of time, I couldn't really draw, draw. If you know what I understand, if you understand what I mean, I, I couldn't really, um, I couldn't really know how to draw. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't feel confident in my ability to draw. And 
that's kind of weird seeing it now but the reason why i got more confident is by just practicing and this is just what it is you just gotta practice and like if somebody ever like wondering like what did you do like how you make your sketches so neat or something like that i practice a hell of a ton lot harder than a lot of people think i would i practice i had to practice precision straightforwardness just being straightforward with myself and kind of art and just having fun and stuff because I think that's the most important thing of, of the whole thing is just having fun with your art and enjoying it for what it is. It may not be the prettiest, trust me, none of the art I have made is too pretty. <laughs> but except for one drawing, I think one painting I did, but it was in high school. It was, I wouldn't say it was one of my best work. I would say one of my least tried projects ever. And I just say that because I really didn't pry on a project. I just wanted to grade. <laughs> I just wanted my grade and get the hell out of there. Anyone else do like did do that do that one time like you you like you have a class that you just didn't like like at all so you, but you was good at it for some reason so you just really work really you didn't work really hard you just did what you had to do and get and get by like and you know you wasn't gonna fail but it's just like you just like oh I don't care about this class this class doesn't mean anything to me. If I had to say a class like that, it might be ironic what I'm about to say, but it's not really, it's not really. Like, the only thing I hate about this this pencil is that it doesn't have an eraser. You might be saying, it doodles, they're not supposed to erase it. I, I have to erase it. Can I write more ideas? I have more ideas. It's unplanned, so doodles are basically unplanned drawings. <laughs> but it's like my class, I feel like I didn't learn nothing in was freaking math. You might be like, why math? Math is so important for in this situation. When you have decent teachers, and you already know who I'm talking about, you freaking sick assholes. <laughs> you, might be, you guys like, dang, salty? I'm like, yes, because I didn't learn nothing in her class. I really did want to learn something. But at the same time, I couldn't learn anything for all the disruptions and all the things that didn't, they didn't care about as a teacher. Like, come on, man. Come on. It's like you gotta, you gotta, like you gotta work, you gotta work with your students, not against your students. But he was just, he, uh, he had his favorites. Everybody have their favorites. I was most likely the least favorite. <laughs> I did just, move, I did just move there that here at that moment, and I was, you know, you know, you know, for, like not caring to care. I as well was moving there, my. 12th grader so I was just like uh okay I'm kind of over this making friends I don't know where situation so whatever happens happens <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious I'm serious and I'm gonna like wrap it up so what I started doing that I didn't I didn't tell didn't really do was I wrote my I did I write I make a paint splatter just some like some my I guess my signature or my signature thing Paint spider with my initials in it. Ah, uh, as well. Keeping on trend with the last disruptive art video. Ah, uh, don't have them. Dang. Yes, I do. <clears throat> we have a Posca, which we're going to use to partly ruin this paper. <clears throat> I just make something out of it. <laughs> oh, this was a good Posca. Oh, no. And wherever they create, they create this. <laughs> well, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please like, subscribe. If anything you want me to do, please comment down below. I want to hear you guys guys say. You guys are awesome, amazing people. And I could have literally done none to start you guys. And you might be a really small channel now, but I can see us. We're going to be up there one day. Thank you guys so much for the support. It means so much to me. See you guys again. Mm, bye. Love you guys. Mwah.